In this video is to show how to print the CISS uh, cartridges. Actually, for most CISS, uh, you really don't need to do that. Uh, even they have a lot of air in the tube. But for some model printer, for example, Workforce 30, C120, um, it will take many time head cleaning for the printer to take the air out all out of this tube. So in this case, you know, for this model, um, CISS, we uh, really recommend to do that uh, to uh, help the printer perform uh, better, have a better result. Okay, uh, here is how to do it. First, uh, take off the travel plug, and uh, you can put the air filter there, which you need to do that uh, later on. Okay. Um, after that, you take off the plug on top of the uh, cartridges. You can see each cartridge has one plug. So now you can put the syringe into the hole and then pay attention on the tube. Okay, you see the ink was full of tube now and uh, the cartridge is full of the ink too. So I suck this much air out. Uh, then you put this plug back to the cartridges. Same thing for the next one. Take off the plug. And take off the plug of the cartridges. Suck the air out. Okay. And then next one. Put in the cartridges. Take off the plug. Out. Then put the plug into the cartridge. The syringe actually is reusable, so you can just clean it. Take off the plug. Do the same thing. Okay. Now then the harsh fish. Take off the new plug. Okay, see all the tube of full ink now, and this actually uh, this I said ready to use after you put the air filter on top of the ink tank. Uh, the air filter is uh, uh, in the same bag with the syringe. Uh, come with the CISS. Okay, thank you.